Hi guys, today in this video, I will be making a simple and powerful inverter circuit using ATX Pulse Transformer. So, I designed the simple oscillator circuit diagram for this project using TL494 PWMIC. Here goes the 12 volt DC input. And here on pin 5, I used 47 NF capacitor, and on pin 6, I used 220 ohms resistor, these both are responsible for setting frequency and duty cycle. And from pin 9 and 10, we get output through 33 ohms resistors which will be fed to MOSFETs. For easy assembly, I converted this schematics into the PCB layout. And the PCB is going to be look like this. You can download both circuit diagram and PCB files, link us in video description. In order to manufacture this PCB, visit jlcpcb.com. And here you can add the Gerber file I provided. After uploading, you can see the preview of the PCB. You can also change quantity and the color of PCBs as per your requirements. And then save to cart for checkout. Within some days I got my order from JLC PCB delivered. And the quality of the PCBs is amazing, and 5 pieces as for just $2. And now it is time to assemble the PCB. So, let's place all the components on the PCB according to the circuit diagram. And after spending some time with the soldering process, I cleaned the PCB with isopropyl alcohol. And here our PCB is looking nice and clean. Now install the TL494 IC into the IC base. Connect the connectors. Now let's check the output frequency using this mini oscilloscope. As you can see the output frequency is set to 25 kHz with 50% duty cycle. Now let's move to the next part. From this ATX board, you can get this pulse transformer which you need to rewind to get high output power. I have already rewind this transformer with primary winding of 3 and 3 turns. And secondary winding of 95 turns to get about 230 volts. I used IRF3205 MOSFETs to use with this transformer. Solder MOSFET drain pins with the transformer. Solder 10 kilo ohms resistor between gate and source pins of both MOSFETs. Connect both source pin of MOSFETs. Solder the 1000 UF capacitor between MOSFET source and center tap of transformer. Connect the extension pins to connect DC input. Now it's time to connect this oscillator circuit with MOSFETs. Connect oscillator output with gate pins of both MOSFETs. Connect the oscillator negative with source of MOSFETs. And connect positive with center tap of transformer. Now connect the lamp holder with secondary winding of transformer. I used lab bench power supply and set voltage of 12.5 volts. Connect DC positive to center tap of transformer. And negative with source of MOSFETs. As you can see, the no load current is only 0.2 ampere. Now let's connect the load. As you can see the lamp is glowing very bright and pulls 5.4 amperes of current. Now with more load, I tested with 12 volt battery and it is working awesome. If you enjoyed the video give a thumbs up. For more useful videos, subscribe the channel. Also check out these recommended videos. Thanks for watching.